guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl is in new williams how are you all doing hope you guys are good hope you guys are fine if you're new to the channel kindly click on the subscription button click on the notification bell to let you know whenever i post any new video okay guys it's the month of march happy new month to every one of you yes guys so yesterday nengi posted this on her instagram page yes people of god she is on the front page of glitz africa she is a cover girl and she also tells her own story on this magazine so if you are a ninja and you've not gotten your copy yet what are you waiting for i really really love the hairstyle i love the look i love everything about this um photo shoot on this magazine she really really looks very very beautiful and yes so if you are a ninja and you have been waiting Waiting for the relaunch of shoes by flora wait no more because nengi said that it will be relaunching very very soon so we are gonna keep our fingers crossed for that yes so away from nengi let's move over to the one and only star girl erica check out her new movie people of god devil in abada it's a star studded movie yes and it's gonna be hitting us by november this year it stars the likes of Efe Irile, Linda Osifo, um, Uche Jumbo, Desmond Elliott, Uzo Arukwe, Etinosa, and so much more, people of God. We cannot wait to see this movie, and we are super, super proud of Erica. Congratulations to her. Now, away from Erica, let's move over to Katarina, the boss lady. So, still on the whole tattoo saga, people of God, even me, I am tired of talking about this tattoo thing, but well, I do not have any other choice than to talk about it because the girl in question you remember that girl that tattooed um katarina's name on her lap yes actually has some words to say to katarina listen to her hey guys it's your girl Susanna. you can't call yourself a boss when you're self-centered no no you don't do that you don't love people that are ungrateful you don't love ungrateful people people that are ungrateful no no they didn't have away from your life i stop i want to say big thank you to Sis T boss for a reply. Like I really do appreciate how boss she did. She is the boss, man. She got she got the swag. She got everything. She is the boss. She is so amazing. Like the attribute of being a boss is caring about other people. Like that is how bosses are. Bosses are not meant to have this stupid attitude that would even contribute nothing to the to the nation. Thank you just watching this video people of god it just justifies what i said initially in one of my videos where i talked about this girl i said this girl is a cloud chaser that she never really was a katarina fan she probably did this because of the money and now it did not work out the way she thought it would and now she she is out here you know bashing and dragging katarina and saying all oh, what not well let her enjoy this fame that she has found now but if that tattoo is like permanent i really don't know how she's gonna be living with herself because i mean the person you're bashing has her name on your lap <laughs> it's really really crazy like i don't even know how she's going to cope with all that whichever one jare we move yes guys moving on people of god let's talk about big brother niger highlights were you able to catch the highlights yesterday well i did i watched it and i just kept my eyes open to things that i really didn't pay attention to before um it's basically a 30 minute show i think they did like two episodes it's a 30 minute show it's not gonna show you they did not show you like everything that happened that day they'll only show you like what they feel is the highlights of the day and that is it so um the people that trended yesterday because of the highlights are number one lucy nengi dora and ozo eric and lilo these six people actually was on the trend table on twitter yesterday night and i'm gonna tell you why so basically yesterday yeah at the highlights we looked at day one and day two we talk, looked at um how they came into the house the bonding um the first head of house game and the relationship that started early in the house yeah so it's basically day two that they stopped so why did these people trend 
Lucy trended because of her crying, people of God. Like, I didn't even notice it, but Lucy was actually the very first housemaid to cry. Like, why was she crying? She was basically crying because she got into the house. And listening to Lucy's story again, it just hit me. Her dad had eight wives, married eight wives. Now, um that makes me understand a lot about lucy more i like i understand how more after hearing that i didn't really pay attention to this initially you know and listening to her talk about you know her dad getting married to eight wives i can understand where she's coming from so yeah yeah that's 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 it about lucy she actually trended because of her crying um nengi trended because you know she was the first head of house and of course her beauty i mean yes and dora and also ah hey god hey god hey god dozo shippers if you know you have once been a dozo shipper or you were a dozo shipper i will not judge you let me know in the comments section of course you know um dora and also trended because of their supposed ship because at the end of the second episode big brother actually showed where um dora and also you know that bed thing where dora was saying that um also pushed her to the extreme end of the bed how they share the bed the first night and so yeah that actually trended so people were like talking about how they wish some people were basically a lot of people were dragging dora because of it so basically yeah that was why dora and also was trending erica lilo well should i even talk about this you already know why they were trending because of their i mean they were the very first ship that formed in the house how they thought they were in love and all whatnot yeah but the highlight for me last night was the dstv twitter handler that guy is mad it's almost as if whenever there is um big brother show the reunion or the highlights big brother just um dstv just gives that guy the phone like let him be handling the tweets can you imagine um this one he says us when we had luck like after a long time and then i put this video of prince laughing it's really really crazy or oh, this one where they said so it was lucy who turned on the inspirational speaker in also <laughs> this is where lucy was crying and also didn't even know what to say and they now this one made me laugh this is lilo and eric and the dsv had now said you are my chocolates you are my rodo you are my honey you are my sugar cane <laughs> is it Larry Rob? That basically means all these things are a lie. Like if you're in Nigeria and you would understand what I'm saying. So yeah, the, all these things are just lies because this ship capsized even before it started. Um, yeah, that's that's basically it. You know, that was my highlight. The DSTV handler was my highlight. The guy is pure cruise. And another thing I noticed about the highlights um was Lacon and Erica. Like these two people. Erica was really Lacon's cheerleader in the house, but we are not going to be going into all that. I mean, we've moved on. We are just going to be seeing it. I said to someone yesterday that this highlight is not really for us, you know. It's really for the housemates so that they will not go and be forming amnesia when they ask them questions about what they did in the house. So, um, we cannot wait for the reunion. And if you are like me that is waiting for the reunion, you have an opportunity to actually ask the housemates questions you have in your heart to ask them by yourself yes so um you can actually send a 30 second video you know or to dstv on their twitter page and tell them or ask the questions that you want to ask and the questions will be featured um at the reunion you probably see yourself at the reunion so that is really really cool and i really pity for this housemate because people are going to be asking crazy questions yes guys so in summary this is actually the highlights or the summary of the highlights last night did you enjoy the highlights how does it feel to watch the highlights again you know after knowing these people you know it's different it feels different you know watching it for the first time you don't know these people now you've known them you've had your faves 
how does it feel watching it for me it felt some it's, it felt awkward like seeing them there kai big brother's camera did not try kai look at how they were looking big brother's camera in the potter potter Mm -mm, it did not try at all thank you guys so very much for being part of my channel if you've not already subscribed kindly click on the subscription button click on the notification bell to let you know whenever i post any new video till i come your way again i remain your darling girl azine williams have yourselves a beautiful day bye guys